Hi, I'm Laura. I've been searching for an escape my entire life. I have grown up playing so many different sports, but nothing has quite consumed me the way that pole dancing has. I ended up quitting my full-time job so that my life could revolve around pole dancing. I live, eat, and breathe pole. Now, it hasn't been the easiest journey. I have torn muscles, I have torn ligaments, I have worked my skin raw and bruised. I've been very defeated, but I've also been very amazed at what I could do over the years. And I am very proud to say that I am both a stripper and an athlete. I live for the crowds, the cheering, the utter shock that I didn't bust my head open, but I also very much value a quiet studio, the sounds of my skin on the pole, and my heel clacking. Pole dancing has very much changed my life for the better, and I am proud to say that I now know who I am, and I'm a pole dancer. I am training probably every day. Um, I do a lot of conditioning on and off the pole. I'm doing a lot of, I go to the, like I go to the gym a lot. I do lots of squats, um, very much into stretching. Flexibility plays a huge role in what I do on the pole. So I'm probably spending a good 50% of my time stretching as well. Get out of your comfort zone. Uh, you will be very shocked at how amazing and empowering you will feel afterwards. Pole is for everyone. Every gender, every body size, every race, every age. It's for everyone and it will amaze you and really, uh, it'll just push you to your limits and you'll be so proud and just thrilled of what your body can do. It's a wonderful feeling. Uh, I come from a very religious family. I am the only person in my family with tattoos, piercings. I'm the only buddy, only one that drinks. I'm the only one that smokes weed. I'm the only one that smokes cigarettes. Um, I'm also the only stripper of my family, but they are so accepting. I honestly think that my parents are just happy I stopped asking for money as soon as I started dancing. <laughs> because I don't need the financial support anymore. It's uh, very much made me independent from my family. So like the black sheep of the family, I guess. Uh, so since I'm lucky enough to be in both worlds, I'm in the exotic dance industry and I'm also in the athletic fitness portion of it. In the fitness portion, the community is so strong. Uh, the people in the dance community are so uplifting and they want to see you do your best and just bang out every single pole goal that you might have. It's a wonderful community. Uh, the exotic dance industry is wonderful when it comes to other girls. The other girls are amazing. Everyone has their mother stripper. Everyone has had someone that's taught them the ropes and showed them what they could do differently on stage. Um, but there's also been quite a lot of backlash. There's been people that try and, um, they try and bring you down because of your title as a stripper. They don't see the athletic part of it, um, but luckily there's a lot less of those kind of people in the industry. Um, I've been very, very lucky with all of my supporters, whether they're my customers, 
or they're just my fans or just the, com the community of dancers. Um, there's more good than there is bad. I'm Laura, and I'm a pole dancer.